There's only she's gone already. Hi everyone, I'm doing an anting vlog today. I almost forgot again. Leave it to me, right? Um, but we're here in Payson. I don't know if you want to take a look at the surrounding area. It's pretty cool. Uh, I remembered because I just found... Let me flip the camera around. And so the reason why I remembered to start recording is because I just found this uh, Fedoli Hayati colony. There's a worker there, and I think the queen is... Yeah, she's right there. We're not going to collect them just because we both have already kept Hayati. Um, but still, it's a cool find to find a queen. And actually, I'm going to show you, we already found a queen today that we also left. Um, she's probably still under the rock, so I will show you her, actually, now that I think about it. So right under here, uh, this rock? I think it was that rock, right? Yeah, so right here is some Campanotus semitestaceus. Semitestaceus. And there was a queen under here. I'm not sure where she's went this off the to. Pile, There's their larvae. See that worker moving it around? And the queen was here. I don't know where she ran off to. Let me look around a little bit. Okay, well I figured out there is actually a hole there that she must have gone into. I thought that that was just a divot when I first saw them. Uh, the reason why we didn't collect them is because, well, I already have a semi-stasis colony. You actually saw them in my last video. Um, and because he didn't want them. True. So... But they're, they're cool to find, and this is a good spot for them, so we're probably going to find more of them. Yeah. So today, the main reason why I'm oh, here... Oh, we found a centipede. Long. Where's do that? Well, it's a uh, geophilomorph. Those are awesome. I might actually collect that. Take a picture of that. Yeah, go ahead. Just a little long boy and a springtail. Look at that. There you go. Oh, yes. So cool. cool. The last time I found one of these was in Illinois. That is a good find. Oh, he's going into a hole. Oh, there we go. Why do you want him? They're just neat. They eat like springtails. Oh, yeah. Well, and they'll eat, like, they're scavengers, so they'll eat, like, pieces of cut-up stuff. There's a cool little monkey. But, like, you can keep dude in, in a... in a cup, you know? Oh, yeah, let me get one of my cups. Oh, yeah, good idea. But as I was saying, before I got so rudely interrupted by this long boy who just fell, hopefully I can find him, um, main reason why I'm here is because I want to catch a Formica Nava colony... And although I don't particularly want to actually keep them, it's because my Polyergus Topafi, which you have seen quite a bit of, um, they are in pretty desperate need of some hosts since they did not hibernate this he year. Go? He's, I just, I keep seeing him and then he keeps disappearing back into the dirt. I'm not going to be that sad if I lose him, but still. Um... But the reason why I need Formica, Nava, is because my polyurgus need hosts, and they don't have pupae yet here, and it's probably going to be until, like, May that they have pupae in the wild. And uh, the polyurgus are just not going to last that long. I also lost the centipede, so that's fun. Um, but they're just not going to last until May without getting some pupae. But if I can catch a colony, I can raise them to pupae in, like, a month. Um, so I'm going to try to catch, like, a relatively decent-sized colony and just raise them to pupae, and then after I get pupae from them, I'll probably just come back and release them. That's all I need from them is, is one raid. So that's the goal for today. I guess you guys will know if I am successful or not. And uh, yeah, so let's keep looking. It's not particularly the most interesting find, but especially out here in Arizona, you don't see them all the time, and that's Pernalapis in Paris. Focus please, thank you. Uh, this worker is actually relatively large for a mature colony, I would assume at least, if I'm like two workers 
under that rock. But uh, yeah, not a terrible find. Mission success. We I have, her. yeah, thankfully he noticed her. Where's she at? She curl up, there she is. Formica Nava Queen. Now, before you say, that's an enormous colony, what are you doing taking their queen? They are very polygynous. There is approximately a 0% chance that this is their only queen. Um, so I do not feel bad taking her, as this colony will be fine. But look at all of these ants. There might actually be another queen in there. I'm not going to really look right now. But I wouldn't be surprised if in the footage I see another one. But these colonies are crazy. So there's all of those, and then all of these which I'm going to be collecting. Such a big colony, such a crazy species. Yeah. Absolutely nuts. So this is a really, really cool find here. These are Parasitic Laceus, subgenus Acanthomyops. Might be something like Laceus coli. It's a pretty good chunk of workers, and uh, if you look down there, Look at all those aphids. So these guys tend aphids primarily for food underground. And uh, you can just see all of them right here. Oh, there's even a larva. Look at that. I'm surprised that they have large brood like that. That might be in a late larva, actually, because I think they overwinter with their late larvae. But I just love the colors on these guys. Definitely would like to keep these at some point. So, cool. Hello. I am recording this after the fact, um, actually about, what, a month after the fact or so, um, because I forgot to record a proper outro in the field. So this is the best you're getting. Enjoy some footage here of just some more random ants that we found that day that I didn't talk about while I was looking at them. Um, I did actually end up collecting one of those geophilomorph centipedes. Um, you'll see that either here or whenever that plays. It was a bit bigger than the one that I found, so I was actually not too sad about losing the first one. But um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, like, subscribe, comment, all that fun stuff. Let me know you liked it. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.